Hey everyone, Escape Dalian here, and today let's open a Garbage Bell Kids Blaster Box. Hey everyone, Escape Dalian here, and today I thought it'd be fun to open Garbage Pail Kids, Kids at Play. So when I was younger, I was a huge fan of Garbage Pail Kids. I was a 90s baby, so the all-new series was my introduction to Garbage Pail Kids. That's when they relaunched in the 2000s, early 2000s. But the original Garbage Pail Kids, of course, are from the 1980s, so I'm sure a lot of the 80s kids, 90s kids are very familiar with Garbage Pail Kids. I'm glad to see Garbage Pail Kids are still around. I don't collect uh, full sets anymore, but every once in a while when I see a new set come out, I like to pick it up, just to uh, open it and kind of go down the nostalgia lane. So let's go ahead and switch to human hands. Now that's better. All right. Well, at some point, I'd like to do a video showing off my Garbage Pail Kid collection from when I was younger. Um, for a while, it was my major obsession when I was in elementary school. And I actually went back on some of the sets and tried to fill in the blanks on the cards that I was missing. Uh, but I still have my childhood collection and I very much cherish it. A lot of good memories there. I remember opening blaster boxes of the all-new series. I used to buy them from Target. And, uh, yeah, just a lot of fun. Very cute. Garbage Pool Kids were originally made to make fun of Cabbage Patch dolls. And I think they even went through a lawsuit back in the day because they looked too much like Cabbage Patch. They had to change it up a little bit, but I'm sure you can tell that those are pretty much mock-ups of Cabbage Patch dolls. Alright, so... 10 packs. Don't know anything about this set, but we'll learn as we go. So here's the pack wrapper. Okay, let's see. Not sure what the rare cards are or anything like that. Dress Upton, Tim Can, Rotate Nate. Kinetic Sandy, Frisbee Frida, Tip Top, Leaky Lita, Surprise Surrey. Okay, so I think these are parallels. So this is one form of rarity is having the border different. I know, depending on the color of border, that oftentimes determines the rarity. And then for those of you that aren't familiar with GPK, so there are A cards and B cards, so it's 67A, 67B. What you're gonna see is the exact same artwork, just with a different creative name. So on this one, Lolly Surprise, Magic Misty, Trampoline Trina, Barf and Barbie, another one of those parallels. Mixy Mickey, Trampolina, Uzi Oscar, and Broken Bradley. A game of Twister that went wrong. Treasure Xavier, Twister Tyler, Rhett Rover, Billard Willard. Roddy Coaster, there's a yellow on the border. Neil Armstrong. Stack Stella. Sticky Mickey. And also, if you're not familiar with Garbage Will Kids, every card is actually a sticker. So you can peel these off. Don't tell the cops, but I did plenty of sticker slapping when I was very, very little. Ring Around Rosie. Unpicked Parson. Burl O Monkey. Luna Balloon, Magic Mick, Harry Hookup, getting a barrel of monkeys, Toy Can Ken, Hatchy Kathy, Horseshoe Drew. Garbage Gary, Hatchy Mall. Horace Shoes, Rocket Rick, Lego, Lance Lance, 
Slide Clyde, Tina Turn. So now I oftentimes see that GPK kind of has themes to their sets. Back in the day, they'd kind of just do random stuff. But uh, obviously, kids that play, I think it's just meant to be childhood toys and childhood fun. So you have like Slip and Slide here. Obviously, that one was Legos. Slip and Sly. Spin Brin. Poor Eamon. Carrie Couture. Dolly Date. This one looks like uh, gray plotting. Ricochet. Peppy Polly. Yeah, I remember those. Rick'em Stick'em. Rock'em Sock'em Robots, something like that. Alright, Poppin' Pain. Red Rooter. Sleepy Selena. Percy Prince. Mr. Beastie Boyd. Hey, Mr. Beast. PJ Party. Patty Ball. That is a new style to a very old artwork in GPK. Ploppy Porter. Ira Ball Pit. I wonder if ball pits at like McDonald's were ever required to be cleaned legally. Probably just filthy. Double Heather. Dumpin' Daryl. Put in his toy box. Eyeball Pit Pete. Poppy It. <laughs> Luke Deleu. Tug of Warren. Bubble Fidget Bridget. Shack Sack. Uh, potato Sack Ace. Ray Blades. Bay Blades. I remember those. Those were sick. Let them rip. Kurt Plunk. Malibu Mindy. Bay Wade. Plastic Pierce. Lona Darts. The Face Grace. Alright, we're on our last pack. So far, I haven't seen anything that pops out to me as like a special rare. I think I just kind of got those uh, different colored borders. Sometimes they have like serialized cards, sketch cards, hollows, lawn dot, peekaboon, karaoke, Labby Gabby, rebellious Ryan, spitting Anya, sneaky Minerva, Mac Track, and ruthless Ruby. All right, so. Looks like these are going to be my hit cards. So I'll just separate these. So it looks like of the hits that I got, green was the most common. Got two of the yellow border and one of the grayish black border. Well, eventually I hope to do a longer video of my GPK collection, but uh, I'll probably pop in once in a while when new GPK sets come out and just open a little bit here and there. But uh, appreciate it if you guys want to give me a like and comment on the video. Maybe let me know if you guys ever had any uh, experience with collecting, opening GPK throughout your life, throughout your childhood. And as always, thanks for watching. This has been Escaped Alien. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.